Hello golfers, PGA teaching professional Todd Kolb here with another segment of Teaching with Technology. And I've got my Swing Catalyst system here and one of the great things about technology and about my Swing Catalyst system is it allows me to look at specific parts of the golf swing. So I'm going to talk about the head movement and also pressure on the feet at address, at the top of the swing, and at impact. So here we are at the dress position. Now I believe all good players at address have definitely a little more pressure on their lead foot, that'd be my left foot for me, versus their trail foot. So I've got a 59-41 split. The phrase I always tell students is let's see 60-40. You'll also notice represented here by the red line that my head is behind the golf ball. In my opinion, the head should be behind the ball at address, at the top, and at the moment of truth, of course, impact. So here's my setup position. My head's behind the ball. I've got my 60-40 split. When we get up to the top of the backswing, what I want to see at the top of the backswing is we're going to see a little bit of change here. The head, of course, is still behind the golf ball, and notice how it hasn't really moved laterally or away from the ball. It's rotated around a nice center spot. But my pressure on my feet has definitely changed. I've now got 76% on my trail foot, only 24 on my lead foot. That's a general thing. It might be a little more, a little less, but you're definitely going to have more pressure on the trail foot at the top of the backswing than you do on the lead foot. This is a good example of that. I've also put a green line here to notice how the hips have rotated. So the upper body and the lower body are rotating. They're not drifting off the target. Now when we move into impact, of course the moment of truth when it all happens, here's what we want to see. Of course we're going to see a change again. The head's still behind the ball. We've talked about that. It's behind the ball to dress, at the top, and at impact. But notice how the hips have strong move towards the target. You'll see that over here. And then therefore, the pressure on my feet has drastically changed. I now have 74% pressure on my lead foot and only 26 on my trail foot. So when you're looking at the golf swing, to summarize this, the head is always behind the golf ball, in my opinion, at address, at the top, and at impact. Your weight's going to move a little bit pressure-wise. You're going to start with a little bit more on the lead foot. At the top of the backswing, you're going to feel more pressure on the trail foot. And then at that moment of truth impact, you're going to definitely see some left. This is just one example of how teaching with technology is allowing us to help you become a better golfer.